Start with a quote. Speak softly and carry a big stick. That. That's correct, George. I, I looked right to my guy. Uh, it is one of the many notable quotes attributed to President Theodore Roosevelt, who's about to be brought back to life, I'm so happy to say, on the big screen. Leonardo DiCaprio is set to star and produce, reuniting with his frequent collaborator, Martin Scorsese, who will direct. And Teddy has quite a story to tell. From wealthy New Yorker to cowboy to war hero to president. And one thing he shares with our 20, with Leo shares with our 26th president, a passion for conservation and protecting the environment. The Wolf of Wall Street partners are also developing two other movies. These guys are busy. The Devil in the White City, based on the best-selling book in which Leo will play a serial killer. And then also Killers of the Flower Moon, which covers the birth of the FBI. All of these sound like great projects. No word on a start date for the Teddy Roosevelt project, but if you've ever read a biography on him, he is so one of the coolest, yeah. Yeah. most interesting guys. I cannot wait to see this. Those two got a lot of work to do. Yeah. <laughs> You take it when you can get it, right? right. You that take some transformation. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah Leo as, as Teddy. Yeah. We'll keep you updated. <laughs> also in pop news this morning, forget Game of Thrones. It's more like the Game of Love on that set. Two co-stars of the HBO hit, Kit Harington and Rose Leslie, reportedly engaged after a secret <laughs> romance. It started on the set five years ago, and buzz about a budding relationship began in around 2012 as their characters Jon Snow and hers became an item on screen. The couple confirmed their real-life romance just this past, oh, in April 2016, making a red carpet debut in London. Harrington opened up to Lomo Vogue about his feelings for Leslie. Yes, that was Italiano. So <laughs> you. <laughs> he said about her, if you're already attracted to someone and then you and then they play your love interest in the show, it becomes pretty easy to fall in love, and we guess it does. The two already share a medieval home in England together, of course, and they are thrilled about getting married, and we're thrilled to share the news with you. Congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> I got nothing, Rob. Uh, finally, it was not show every day at the baseball park. For St. Louis Cardinals fan Andrew Gutermuth, take a look. Chicago Cubs shortstop Addison Russell going for an impressive catch that has him diving into the stands, coming up with something other than the ball. Listen up. He's got a handful of nachos is what he has. Oh, oh my. So when Andrew's oh. full plate... Of loaded nachos, <laughs> took a nosedive. <laughs> Addison. The Cubs, add, uh, Addison makes sure the fan does not leave with a chip on his shoulder. He comes out on the field with a fresh plate of nachos for Gutermuth, who was actually there to root for the Cardinals. The Chicago Cubs sharing the video, tweeting, new rule for the ballpark. If a player brings you nachos, they automatically become your new favorite player. <laughs> but alas, the Cubs still nacho day. The Cards went home with the win, 8-7. Uh, oh, I He loves nachos. A 200 pound ball player coming straight at him. Don't lose the nachos. Know, right. you saw that. <laughs> he, he wasn't happy when they flipped over. He was like, what's up? I mean, he was going for a beautiful catch. Oh, Not my you. nachos. <laughs> That's all I got for you guys. Ride that pony all the way. All right. Thank you, Lara. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.